it's a new year. Have you changed the year and the copyright date on your Joomla site? In this video, I'll show you how you can set it so that you never have to worry about changing that again. It will update automatically. Brought to you by MySites.Guru. Do you have a Joomla site? Of course you do. Head on over to MySites.Guru and get a free site audit for it. Hey there, Joomla fans. Remember me? I'm Tim Davis. I haven't done one of these videos in over a month because I was super sick. So was my wife. But we're feeling better and I'm back. Although I'll still have a bit of cough, so there'll be lots of jump cuts in this video. Thanks for tuning in to Maintenance Monday number 248 here on the Basic Joomla Tutorials YouTube channel where I show you my favorite extensions, tools, and tips for building and maintaining Joomla sites. I also work on Joomla sites, build them, maintain them, and uh, migrate them to Joomla 4. So if you're looking to hire someone short-term or long-term or just to get you out of a spot, send me an email, tim at cybersault cybersalt.com and uh, let's talk. Okay, so let's turn our attention to the screen and we'll tackle this topic today. Shout out to my client, Carson City Coin Collectors of America, who gave me permission to use their site as an example. You'll see in the footer down here, their copyright is 2005 to 2022. They actually manually changed it to 2023, but I switched it back just for this tutorial. And what we're going to do is put some PHP code in the footer here that will always show the current year. Now to do that, we first of all are going to use a plugin from Regular Labs and it is called Sorcerer. And here it is, it's a free program. So let's download this. The link will be in, in the video description below. I'm gonna download this to my computer right here. It's already there for me saving and practicing this to make sure everything was lined up. And it's great. Okay, next we're going to go to the back end of this site. Now you notice they have the old fashioned menu here in Joomla 4 that, uh, that Foca has put together, mimics what was in Joomla 3, and uh, they requested that, and I was happy to set that up for them. We're going to go to Extensions, Manage, and Install, and then we're going to upload the package that we just downloaded and install Sorcerer. Now, what this is going to do is add a button to the editor in your Joomla site. And we will see that as we go to extensions and site modules, because in this case, the copyright information is down here in the footer module. It's a custom module. So we're going to click on footer. Let me just close this bottom bar here. And you'll see here it is copyright 2005 to 2022. So now what we're going to do is we're going to take out the 2022. All right. We're going to go down to the new code button and we're going to paste some PHP code into a page right here. And to do that, I'm just going to hit control V and I'm going to zoom in and leave this for a second. So you have a good frame for you to pause and type this out because YouTube won't let me put this in the description. All right. So we're going to go insert. Now we get that code in here in between the source tags. We save. And we go back to the page, we refresh, and look down here, it says 2023. There's really just PHP code there, but you know what? In 2024, it's automatically going to update. Do this and you will never have to change the copyright date on your Joomla site ever again. Subscribe for more videos. Until the next time, enjoy your Joomla sites and God bless.